<laughs> Mommy, stop crying, sweetheart. I just have something stuck in my eye. <laughs> 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 My lord, the filthy Morris are attempting to overtake Koopa King. You gotta come back, my liege. You're our only hope. My lord, come on, dude. What, you just moved to town and you get to be king? Well, I think you're a little pussy. Punch that more in the face, king. Wow. Yeah, he can't talk to you like that. Boom, king, go. Teach him a lesson, my lord.
dragon roaring. It's pissed. Ah, oh, man. He's still not dead? <laughs> wow, did he just fart on a dragon? Heck yeah, he did. Don't end your turn, Ray. It's gonna hit you. Ah, our king dodged it. Ah, damn it. Okay, if you get a fire breath attack, our king gets his hammer of heaven. You can't stop the kick. Hard, hard. the street, damn kids! Clear! As I was saying, you- Defeated the dragon! No freaking way! That kid's amazing! Wow! Did you see that? The kid's amazing! Maybe there's a way in through the garage, my lord! If there's a way in through the garage, the king will find it! Yes, only the king can find the secret way in through the garage! If, I mean, if there is one! Yes! Only the king with his infinite wisdom and strength can get past this impassable barrier! King was going to do a sweet jump, but then he just did that. You're dead. Speak, Bard! What happened to the stick of truth? The wizard had it thrown into the ocean. Lies! You shall feel the wrath of the Moorish! Unhand him, you heathens! Release the Bard, or you'll have the king to deal with! 
the king. They say he can slay a dragon with one blow. That's right. And if you don't... Uh, wait, wait, whoa, where is the wizard? Uh, I thought he was with you guys. Now we got a distress signal to come help him here. <laughs> Wizard is gone! My name is the kid. I'm from the future. Dude, we said we're not playing that anymore. Yeah, we're all split up. What's the point? This is the point! In my time, there is a massive crime wave and missing cats. I knew my only hope was to assemble the team. Hey, you can't switch games like this. Where's the stick of truth? Shut up, Kevin. This isn't about some dumb stick. There's a cat in trouble, and it's the key to finding the crime syndicate new to our town. In the future. Crime syndicate? That's... That sounds too heavy for Coon and friends. Well, what do you want, Clyde? You want the fucking Freedom Pals to find the missing cat? Get the $100 reward and make their superhero franchise more popular? Fuck the Freedom Pals, dude. That's right. Poopsikins! There's a loud ringing coming from your basement playroom. The Coon Alert! Come on, Coon friends. Go get your stuff and report back to the Coon Lair. In the future, Coon and friends assemble. Sorry, guys, you can't play with us. We're playing superheroes now, and you guys are dorks. Nobody asked me if I wanted to play superheroes. Maybe we could play our own game. Like... I've been thinking about joining a gang. This might be just the kick in the pants I need. Oh, hello. The boys are down in their little basement playroom. Eric and his friends are so imaginative. I'm afraid little Eric put a lock on the door to keep me out. I'm sure he has the passcode written down here somewhere.
this, officer. Somebody appears to have put lava in front of my door. Well, no, it's not hot, but my son told me I will burn to death if I try and cross it. Uh-huh. Oh, yes, he did tell me that if I step on a crack, it would break my mother's back. It won't. Fuck. You. Mom. Maybe we should go to reasons and see if the waitresses know anything. That's not enough, Mosquito. We have to act fast before the Freedom Pals can. A hundred dollar reward. Do you know what that could mean to our superhero franchise? That cat looks pretty old. Maybe he just died in the gutter somewhere. Human Kite, do I have to remind you that as of right now, Freedom Pals have a hundred followers on Instagram? We have six. The five of us and Billy Turner, who's a ginger. This is the key to finally beating those fuckers. But where do we start looking? That cat could be anywhere. We need to split up. Mosquito, take to the air and check out all the city parks. You got it. Mosquito, away. Human kite, see if the cat is stuck up a tree somewhere. You've got the storm drain, Super Craig. Super Craig. Fast pass, I need you to use your superhuman speed to get to the mayor's office and tell her we're on the case. Don't worry, Coon. You can count on fast pass to get there. Excuse me. Hey, hey! Do not touch that! That device can blow up the entire Milky Way galaxy! Jesus, fuck! Mom! The new kid is trying to play with the cube of ultimate destruction! You be nice to all your friends, Eric. Be a good sharer. Good sharer? It'll blow up the fucking galaxies! Stupid bitch! Look, dude, we already told you, you can't play. You aren't a superhero. You don't have a costume. You don't have any superpowers. <sighs> all right, look, you can watch us play superheroes as long as you don't get in the way. Make yourself useful. Go grab me the Stephanasy device. It's over there. You seriously can't find the Stephanasy device? A superhero use inspection mode, you know. Well, that took long enough. Stephanasy device active. <laughs> You really want to be a superhero, huh? Play with the big boys? <sighs> well, maybe. Maybe you can be useful. Have a seat at the table, douchebag. Let's see, mosquitoes, ABLs. Jesus Christ, are these even in a human language? All right, in order to play superheroes, you have to have a superhero persona. Then you can fill out your character sheet on Coonstagram. Do you have a Coonstagram page? Oh boy, you're not even on Coonstagram, huh? Well, I guess I can create one for you. I can believe I'm going to So the first thing we need to fill out on your character sheet is your class. You know, what kind of superhero are you? Since you're a newbie, you can only choose between three for now. Brutalist. Brutalist. Speedster. Blaster. A blaster with range powers like Cyclops. Okay, douchebag, but now, we need to find out what terrible thing in your past drives you. You see, douche, all superheroes have a compelling backstory. It's from that backstory that their powers gain meaning. Let's take you back to when you were just a child. You lay awake that night, like so many other nights. You couldn't sleep because you knew you weren't like the other kids. You walked to the mirror. You walked to the mirror.
Over there, the mirror. You looked in the mirror and you felt alone. And that's when it happened. A loud noise. You swore you could hear your mother calling for help. You left your room. You left your room. Out in the hallway, you saw two intruders in front of your parents' door. You had to stop them from hurting your parents. You knew you had the power to stop them, so for the first time, you called upon your blaster powers. As a blazing blaster hero, you began to overheat as the fire in your belly ignited. You wasted no time delivering sick burns into the villains before you. You fried the bad guy. Flames clear. The intruders realize what they were up against. Shit! This little flamer means business! Didn't your mom tell you not to play with fire? The intruders moved in to attack! You've left us no choice, kid! Oh, 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 oh. With the enemies closing in, you gave yourself some space by knocking your bows back! But the intruders wouldn't take getting pushed around lightly. Hey, you can't push us around like that. <laughs> Little did they know, they set themselves up for destruction. So much range. I'll just get out of the way. His comrade fallen, the extra ugly one closed in. Not so hot now, you little flamer. Yeah, we showed him. You were gravely injured, but the intruder's blows only awakened the fires that burned within you. You swallowed the pain and unleashed your ultimate attack. And so you beat them. All seemed to be okay. But then you finally reached your parents' door. And what you saw when you opened that door changed your life forever and led you to fighting crime. You were too late. Because when you opened that door, you saw... You saw your dad fuck your mom. Wow. That's a pretty heavy backstory. You fight crime because you never forgot the night you weren't in time. And you saw your own father, the man you trusted, fuck your mom. It's like a ripple in time you can't ever change, isn't it? All right. Now that you're a superhero, I have a mission for you. I need you to go out into town and try to get as many followers as you can on Coonstagram. It's the only way our franchise will survive. New inventory available at the Keenster. Thank you for shopping at the official store of Cunit Friends. Wonderful. 
I'll see you on the internet. Go away, I can't take a selfie with a nobody like you. Go away, I can't take a selfie with a nobody like you. Oh! New kid, looks like you've reached the edge of our known universe. Beyond there lies the limits of time and space. Look, I only selfie with popular people. PJ's kid. If you see Butters, could you tell him he's grounded again? Are you on some kind of house exploring adventure? You kids have such fun. Luckily, our valuables are safely locked in our bedroom. <gasps> oh, I've said too much. When I go home, I'm gonna play Star Trek VR, and it's gonna be awesome! I can't be in a photo with someone with so few followers. Sorry. I'm, I'm busy, kid. Just can't get this mailbox open. Ugh. Hey, you, you got it open. You're the real deal, little superhero. <laughs> Got it open. You're the real deal, little superhero. A, a selfie? Sure, kid, let's do it. Okay, nice. Okay, I guess you're popular enough to selfie with. Okay, I guess you're popular enough to selfie with. We're friends now, I guess. I don't even want to play superheroes. Well, I guess we have enough mutuals that we can selfie. Not bad, but hope You're gaining followers pretty fast. Keep up the good work. I'm still having trouble reaching some of the Kuhn friends. You might want to see what's going on.
Okay, I guess you're popular enough to selfie with. <gasps> We're friends now, I guess. Mm, okay, we can get a selfie together. <gasps> Cool, we follow each other now. Who would do such a thing? It's just so mean. Hope you brought me something good, Billy. Your grandpa's not getting any younger, Billy. I need those rubbers. No way, Kurt. You're following cop. Stupid autocorrect! I typed her! Stop! Hey, kid, you know anything about this? Somebody's keying my wife's car at night. It's happening every night. I thought it was just one of you damn kids, but we'll... Here, come here, take a look at this. Whoever's scratching the car is also leaving notes. I'm just scared it's a jilted lover or something. You won't forget me that easy. I thought we had something. I'll tell the world about you, bitch. Listen, I'm sick of having to buff this shit out. If you can catch whoever's keying my wife's car tonight, I'll follow you on Coonstagram. Trust me, you want me as a follower. I'm a pretty big deal in this town. of the clouds. That's home base to human kite. Perhaps you can find him inside. Who the hell are you? Really? You sent a newbie to my distress call? You're such a dick, Coon. Sorry, kid, but my problem is too big for a rookie. A few days ago, there was an anomaly in the universe. 
Another version of me, the human kite from an alternate dimension, showed up here and is destroying everything. Right now, it's upstairs in my room. I don't think anything can stop it. Human kite from another universe is behind this door. I can't fight him for obvious reasons, you know, alternative universe paradox shit. So you are going to have to take him out. You've gotta really kick his ass, dude, so that he wants to return back to his universe on the East Coast. You ready? All right, go get him. Uh, zoom. Oh, hey, Kyle, I'm big. Who's your friend? Did he come to play with us? All right, me from another universe, it is time for you to go back to your universe. What do you mean, Kyle? We're a team, remember? I'm not from another universe. We're like best super pals. <laughs> As you can see, he is the one running around giving the human kite a bad name. He was sent here to destroy me and weaken my power. No, no, I came to spend two weeks with my cousin and wanted to play superheroes. And then he said, okay, what superhero do you want to be? And I said, I want to be human kite. But he said, you can't be human kite. I'm human kite. And I said, well, why can't we be human kites together? So I went to Aunt Sheila and I said, I want to be human kites together. And she told him he had to do what I said because I was the guest. Remember? I'm sorry, me from another universe, but it is time for you to learn that playing superheroes is too painful. New kid, you must now destroy my alter ego. Oh, Jesus, we're gonna fight? That's right. If you really want to play, then this is how you do it. Well, all right. Anything to make me and my cousin more alike. Prepare for battle, weakling. <laughs> I haven't done a whole lot of sparring. Is this a no contact thing? Full contact, not sparring. Oh, I'm afraid that's impossible. I didn't bring my pads. Happy! Get him, new kid! Cousin Kyle, we can beat him if we join forces. Yeah, I really want to, but parallel universe rules say I can't. Oof. Hey, take it easy, Tiger. I bruise very easily. Oh my, there's a lot of decisions in this game, aren't there? You cannot play! That's a decision you could make! Oh, don't be silly. Oh, you guys, time out. My vertigo is starting to act up. Jeez, come on, dude. <laughs> oh, oh my, hot, 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 hot. Okay, I think my inner ear fluids have stabilized now. Uh, that last hit didn't count, right? I'm undoing that damage, okay, Kyle? <sighs> That's some classic alternate universe bullshit. Does anyone have hydrocodone cream, preferably prescription strength? Hold on, I need a timeout so I can use my inhaler. Hey. Cousin Kyle, I called the timeout and he didn't listen. You know my asthma flares up when I exert myself. Yeah, I think this would be a lot more fair if I had a shield. Some kind of shield, like a like the sacred Torah, which also has a great sentimental value. Dude, human kite is an alien. There's no Jewish stuff involved. And you can't just make up powers in the middle of a battle. I'm not making it up. It's totally canon in my alternate universe. Phew. Didn't your parents tell you not to play with fire? Because look what's happening now. Wait, 
I thought I should get this turn instead of the new kid because he didn't wait when I said time out earlier, so I think it should be my turn now. Are you kidding me? That's totally cheating. That wasn't too hard, right? I don't want to cause any permanent damage. I think you sprained my nose. All right, here we go, my super ultimate power. Get ready. Are you ready? Oh, Jesus. Okay, fast kite from an alternate universe. I better go back to my universe. Oh, you're leaving? Dude, that sucks. Yeah, I'll be going back to my universe now, human kite. I need some camphor phonique for my ear because I got a scrape on it by being farted on. Dude, I don't know how to thank you. From now on, call on me whenever you need help. Okay, yeah, just two heroes hanging out. But Lord, those are sixth graders. They're the most vile, evil beings known to superheroes. You guys are stupid. Everyone knows. Sixth graders are way too powerful for you, rookie. Just keep walking. Don't even look at them. Hey, look at the stupid little four feet. You better get lost, dork. Dude, shut up about my mom's beat. When I finish kicking your butt, I'm gonna kick your stupid frog butt. Frogs don't have butts, they have clothes. Ew! Huh. Target of my unbridled rage. Ew, so gross. <laughs> Feel the wrath of human kite. Thank you. 
The bully has become the bully. I'm still the bully. Titty Twister! Uh oh, that looked painful. Ah. Oh, I'm up. Okay. <laughs> you want to put some aloe on that? You got him on the ropes. Are turning. Shut up, Forthy. Nothing else beating on you guys is really therapeutic for me. <laughs> uh. Have your boyfriend massage that for you. More waiting for you in middle school. Time to fly. Wow, you're so brave. Wow, you really made him. You saved me. Really want a selfie with me? <laughs> Watching you defeat that sixth grader was so cool. Maybe I can become as strong as you one day. Slow news day. I guess we're in for a quiet week. You new here? You don't look like one of Henrietta's chums. Uh, don't talk to me, conformist. Get out of here! Are you a conformist? I can tell. This town's going to shit, like even more than usual. So we figured we'd try this black magic spell we looked up online. But Henrietta's stupid brother stole the sacred tome. We need to do the ritual. So we're screwed. If you could find that tome, kid, well, that'd be pretty goth of you. I'm not really into the selfie thing. I cannot conform with you guys all day. Psh, no way, conformist. Slow news day? I guess we're in for a quiet week. Soon you will be approaching Super Craig's Fortress of Solitude. Super Craig hasn't checked in. I hope nothing's wrong.
Greetings, citizen. It is I, Super Craig. I'm sorry, but I cannot assist anyone with their problems right now. Super Craig can't find his guinea pig. Go tell the coon that I'm not playing until I find Stripe. He's not just a normal guinea pig. He belongs to me and my ex-boyfriend. That's right, Super Craig is gay. I'll bet Stripe is down in the basement again. We should start in the basement. That's the last place I saw him. I'm thinking maybe he smelled the dog food downstairs. I'll stand by the stairs and keep him from escaping. You do the rest, butthole. Be careful. This is probably the most challenging mission you've ever been given. Look, there he is. Oh, sweet. Those might be handy. You're welcome. Quick, hit that box with your thing. Well, shit! I can't believe you just did that! You're so good at this! Move that thing out of the way! Wow, that looked like it required so much skill! Use the power of your ass to overwhelm this super sensitive spell! Stripe a brilliant rescue, but it wasn't just me. We have Butt Lord and his sickening asshole to thank. You did it, newbie. If you ever need help, you can count on Super Craig. Psst, new kid. Hey there, are you one of Craig's friends? You looking for Craig? Me? Let's just say I'm an art collector specializing in a delightfully modern and extremely confusing Asian art form known as Yaoi. Crazy, right? But this stuff is worth a fortune to the right buyer. If in your adventures you find any of these, bring them to me. I will reward you handsomely. Come back with any new pieces you find. Not bad, new kid, not bad. Way to go out and get some followers on Instagram. I think you're ready for the next level. Head back to the coon lair. Coon? Ah. You die! Don't even touch it! Wait, this, this doesn't even make sense. Who would put lava there? <laughs> Take that, Coon Fred! Professor Chaos! That's right, Coon! I have strategically placed lava throughout the town. I can't make it too easy for you. What good is the world without a little... Chaos? <laughs> okay, turn it off now. We'll deal with chaos when the time is right. For now, we have to keep our eye on the prize. Coon, out! Watch this, bro! This one I learned from Usher, bitches! You tampons can't even step to this shit!
of wacky races. The Prime Minister of Japan has informed...